degree in graphic design and motion graphics with a specialty in business as well. I've also got qualifications in law, uh, business studies and psychology, so that's a big interest for me. Um, uh, as John said, the point of difference for me is I look at the psychology of your designs, not just the actual prettiness of it. I use red because of ABC and I use black because of this reason, not just because it looks cool, because that's why you want to get clients. You want to get them because you're different and not just because you look pretty or there's a nice swish that goes across the top of your logo, etc. etc. So, um, for example, of my clients, I worked for the government uh, in the UK, so I worked um, with the Metropolitan Police on a court trial, and this was to help put about seven uh, terrorists in prison. So that's quite a good start for my career. I was only uh, 19 at the time, and what I did was I made the evidence, so there's 3,000 pieces, I made evidence interactive for the court trial. So everyone had tablets um, in the jury, and what they did is they swiped through the interactive evidence um, so that it actually made sense, because they have been following these terrorists for five or so years. There was so much stuff they needed to make sure that the jury actually understood uh, what was going on. Um, and I couldn't put scary faces and big red lines and skulls around it and things like that. I had to make sure it was very neutral, but at the same time engaging. So that was my first sort of big break as a, as a graphic designer, and I was only 19 at the time. So yes, I'm somewhat young, uh, some of you know my age, um, but it doesn't mean that I don't come with bags of experience. Cool. So um, what else do I want to talk to you about? Okay, um, another point of difference. So does anybody know what a style guide is? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's one of the big, big 